Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video. So I'm currently recording this video on the Canon G7X Mark II. Now I actually made an unboxing video of this camera back in 2020, so I'll leave it linked right in the description below if you guys wanna check it out. So tomorrow, something is gonna be coming in the mail, which is gonna be the Canon EOS R50. So it's like a compact camera, but you can change up the lenses, which is gonna be pretty cool. So, what I'm gonna be unboxing here is this camera bag that I got in the mail. Uh, my mom ordered this for me, which is pretty freaking awesome. So, thank you very much, mom, if you're watching this. Uh, give a like for my mom. Uh, and also, I, you know, I, I need the money. <laughs> okay, let's open up this bag and let's see what this is. I mean, we know that it's a, it, it, it's a bag. Like, why am I saying, let's see what it is? It's like the stupid YouTube hype stuff. Bro. Ooh. Yeah, it smells like a bag. So this is the bag. It looks very nice. I've seen a lot of vloggers use a bag. Oh good, it has that one strap. That's nice. I like it. So let's open up this zipper. Like which one do I put the camera in? Okay, I'm assuming this is where the camera would usually go. I could be wrong, so please excuse me. And there is more zippers. Zippers right here. Zipper right here. Literally. Uh, uh, these zippers are really good because I can put in little cables and stuff, which is awesome. Another zipper right here. Another little pocket. It just keeps going. Another zipper right here. Um, okay, this is a bit of a big one. Wow. Okay. What is this? Oh. Okay, this is kind of weird. Okay. Ah, nice, 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 nice. This is it. I'm assuming you can put like the lenses right in here and you have a little more space over here for like cables and stuff. That's awesome, I like it. I really like it. Nice. I got this tripod right here. So I got this tripod at Best Buy. Uh, I figured that I was due for a brand new tripod now the old tripod I have is pretty good, it works good, but the problem is something is going wrong with the legs, I can't close them up, which I don't know why it's happening. It was actually like a couple of bucks at a thrift store, no, or an antique store, something like that. But I figured I'd get something like this, which is pretty cool. So this is the, um, yeah, it, it's a tripod. Just slips right out. Ooh, it's a little bit heavy. Wow, that's nice. Um, okay. Where do I just, where do I just rip it up? Yes, I do. All right, works like a tripod. Very smooth. Wow. And there's also this thing here. Uh, I don't know what that is. So, I'm gonna have to wait till tomorrow to get the camera in the mail. So, I will see you guys tomorrow. It's not transition. Alright, so I'm filming with manual mode right now because it's annoying when the brightness automatically shifts. So everything is going to stay in one specific setting and it's not going to change at all. Because imagine moving around and then the brightness will change. So that's why I like using manual. Yeah. So I actually made an unboxing video when I unboxed the Canon G7X Mark II. I think I did mention this already. Go check it out, link's in the description below. I got this camera for my 15th birthday back in 2020, and I just turned 19. Isn't that crazy? Feast your eyes. Get rid of that. You ready? Boom. Okay. Uh, this here it is, the Canon EOS R50. There it is. Let's open it up. Oh my goodness. Wow, this is gonna be so cool. Fresh from Amazon. Instructions, yeah, whatever. We don't need that. Oh, oh here we go. Battery charger, that's cool. Battery, what size does it look? I do wonder if this battery is the same one this camera uses. That would be nice. 
Uh, I actually, I think it might be a little bit bigger. Yeah, this one's a little more blockier, but that's okay. Well, battery. Can't go wrong with a good battery. I think this is the lens. This has got to be the lens. Ooh, got the lens. All right. Oh, and by the way, on Amazon, I just ordered a adapter so I can put any lens on for 15 bucks. So that's a good deal. Oh man. Here we go. Boxing. Oh my god, it's light. It's light. Wow. Why is it so it, it's so light? Like it's light. That is insane. Oh, here we go. That's the thing right there. Yeah. Wow. Wow, this is very light. Does this zoom in or not? Oh, yes it does. Wow. Okay, cool. Got the lens, all good to go. And now, for the main piece. The body of the camera. All right, let's freaking do this. Ooh, <laughs> look at this. Oh man, this is so nice. I've been looking at this camera for a while. I'm glad that I finally have it now. Here we go, here we go. Boom. Hold on, come on. Look at that. That is nice. It is actually light. Like, it's not heavy. That's what I was really worried about, that this will be heavy, but it's so much lighter than I thought. What the hell? That is insane. Oh, here we go. Put the lens over. There you go. Hey guys, so I'm now recording with this camera. And I think so far it looks pretty good. Uh, I think I still need to get used to the settings. But check it out, you can like zoom in, which is pretty awesome. So I'm using the auto mode right now. I think the lighting in this scene isn't exactly fantastic. But this is actually a pretty comfortable camera to use. So, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Okay. I'm now shooting in the exact same settings, except I'm now using the built-in stabilization. I don't, I don't think it's built-in stabilization, but I'm shaking it. Not bad. So, Stabilization seems to work pretty good. Yeah, seems to work fine. Problem is the lighting in this scene isn't very great, but I think the stabilization is definitely pretty good. So anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed seeing me unbox this video. And if you guys want to see more videos, please hit that subscribe button and hit that notification button so that way whenever I post a new video, you will be notified as soon as I post. Now I'm sure the camera quality will look very much better in this room because this room is very well lit and on the screen it seems to look fine and it seems to be tracking my eyes perfectly fine like I am having no issues. It's very impressive. I have this little microphone plugged in. I really hope that it works and if it doesn't work, oh well. Okay, have a good one. Bye.